the University of Wisconsin-Stevens Point men's basketball program has a rich history unlike any other school at the Division III level. They have won four national titles and a conference best 29 regular season conference championships. In addition to their regular season conference titles, the Pointers have also won nine conference tournament championships. This is the most by any team in the conference since the tournament was introduced in 1999. The program has also produced eight conference players of the year, nine all defense players, and 80 all conference players, 40 of which won the honors multiple times. A majority of the traditions and iconic history stem from one place, Bennett Court at Quant Fieldhouse. Opened in 1971, Bennett Court at Quant Fieldhouse serves as the exclusive home to the Pointers men's basketball team and owns one of the largest seating capacities of any facility in central Wisconsin with 2,787 seats. The field house is named after Hale Quant, who coached football, men's basketball, and baseball from 1947 to 1962. Quant won 178 games as the head men's basketball coach in 15 seasons for the Pointers. On February 7, 2009, the court at Quant Fieldhouse was named after former Pointers coaches Dick and Jack Bennett. Dick and Jack Bennett both have had such an enormous impact on this program and I've been fortunate to be able to watch that up close and personal. I was an assistant with Jack Bennett at Wisconsin Rapids and that was when Dick had this program just turning to become one of the elite programs at the NAIA level in one of the top basketball programs in the country. And of course with Terry Porter and six straight conference titles and the national runner-up at Kansas City, that was really what stirred this community to become a great basketball community and it's been like that ever since. Terry Porter is the most well-known basketball player in the program's history. Porter went on to be drafted in the first round of the NBA draft by the Portland Trailblazers in 1985. He was a two-time NBA All-Star. Porter was inducted into the UWSP Athletic Hall of Fame in 1992. Dick Bennett started his college coaching career at UW-Stevens Point in 1976 and spent nine seasons at the helm of the Pointers men's basketball team, compiling 173 wins in nine seasons. In his final three seasons, from 1982 to 85, he guided the team to a 79 and 13 record. He was named NAIA Coach of the Year after the 1983-84 season, leading the team to a 22 and 3 mark and a national runner-up finish. That was really a special time in pointer basketball. Dick went on to take UW Green Bay to two NCAA Division I tournament appearances and led UW Madison to an NCAA Final Four appearance in 2000. Dick's brother Jack also had an amazing impact on this program's history. Jack Bennett's coaching career spanned 34 years throughout Wisconsin high school and collegiate basketball. Bennett coached seven years at Rhinelander High School prior to replacing Bob Parker at UW-Stevens Point in 1996. In nine seasons at UW-Stevens Point, he led the Pointers to five conference titles, five NCAA tournament appearances, and two national championships en route to becoming, at the time of his retirement, the school's all-time winningest coach with a 256 record. When Jack came here as a head coach, we had never won a national title. This program, as good as it had been, and one of the special programs in college basketball, there was not a national title, and Whitewater had two and Platteville had four. So to win that first national title and then go back to back with Jack, that was also a time that was very special for our program because it put us among the elite and we had that crowning jewel that we needed and made a statement about what this program was about. 
Great coaching has been a staple of Pointer basketball. In addition to Coach Quant and the Bennett coaches, current head coach Bob Semling has left his mark on the program. Semling enters his 15th season as the head basketball coach and has been a part of all four national championship teams. He was an assistant under Jack Bennett during the 03-04 and 04-05 championship teams. He took over as the head coach in 2005 and has won two championships since. He is the all-time winningest coach in UW-Stevens Point program history, currently sitting at 307 wins. His 77.2 career winning percentage was the highest among active Division III coaches and ranks 10th all-time among all divisions for coaches with at least 10 seasons. He has been named WIAC Coach of the Year five times and National Coach of the Year twice. Part of what makes UWSP such a unique place is their fan base. I recall the days as an assistant in high school coming over here and the gym was packed. It was standing room only. There were several thousand, we're talking some of the best record crowds ever, three, four thousand people in Quant Gym back the old days. And we just packed them in and they were, you know, standing room um, in the corners up on the balcony. It was really a, uh, incredible atmosphere. What makes it really unique and really special is, first and foremost, the fans. I mean, we have been one of the top teams in the nation for 20 straight years, we've been top 10. Some years were as high as fourth or fifth in the country in attendance. And so that's consistent, and it has been for four decades now. So that makes Quad Gym really special. Former player and current assistant coach, Cannon O'Hearn, talks about the impact that the fans have had during his time as a player. There are no better fans in all of Division Three athletics, and I, I truly believe that. You know, when I came on my visit, and I know this is the same for a lot of the guys I've played with, but you come on your visit and you sit behind the pointers and, and you see 1,500 people to 2,000 people standing up and clapping for starting lineup intros or going wild every time that we make a good play or, or getting on the refs every time they blow a call. There's nothing like it and we've got over 200 season ticket holders that have been coming to games for 40 years and, and we have a whole bunch of events where we invite our fans and getting to sit down and talk to them and hear all the stories and start to understand what pointer basketball means to them. For four years, you come in every single day with your teammates and, and you battle it out. The guys that you've become brothers with every single day. And, and then to go out there and play games in front of sold out crowds, that all provides some of the best memories that I've had in my entire lifetime. And to think that it all came on, you know, a 50 by 94 piece of wood is, is really something special to me and, and it's crazy. I never thought that I would experience the things that I've experienced on this court and grown in the way that I've grown as a person because of the things that I've gone through on this court with some of my best friends and I'm gonna take all those memories with me throughout my life and I'm gonna continue to be best friends and brothers with all the guys that I've gotten really, really close with.